All right, so today I'll be showing you guys seven different tips and tricks that will help you improve faster in Arm Wrestle Simulator. So let's get right into it. My first tip is to not use biceps because the biceps is uh, just the slowest one to get strength on. So I would always recommend doing the hand strength or the uh, punching, the knuckles. Uh, so yeah, if you do these, you will get faster strength and you will become like better at the game. So yeah, never do biceps because they are pretty much slower. I can get, just show you guys right now. So if I equip the dumbbells right here and do the clicks, I will get 1.5 million every click and it's like every second or something like that. And when I do the hand strength, let's just get here and equip it, uh, I will get 1.9 million every second, which is a lot better than the biceps. So yeah, that's why you shouldn't do the biceps because it's just useless. And then when I do the knuckles, you see I get 800k every like split second, something like that. So yeah, actually just don't do biceps, it's not worth it. And yeah, let's just get to the next tip. My next tip is to use the codes in the game because the codes will give you like special rewards. For example, like boosts and yeah, just free stuff. So I would always recommend you guys using the codes. And yeah, one code I can show you guys right now is noob. Uh, just like that, I have already done that one. Uh, but yeah, I will leave all of the codes in the description if you guys want to redeem them. So yeah, make sure to redeem all of the codes because you will get some boosts. And if you don't know how to use the boosts, you just have to go into the store and then go to potions. My third tip is to always claim the rewards you have, like the free gifts. Uh, for example, here we have all of the different things you can get. You can get like boosts and free pets and stuff like that. So it's always worth it to claim the free gifts. And you can also do the spin the wheel right here. Uh, this wheel will give you like free pets sometimes. Uh, right here it's 0.1% chance to get that pet, which is pretty low. Uh, but you'll still be able to get some wins and some potions, which is pretty good. So you should always be able to collect these. And if you haven't already, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying the video so far. Or if you're finding this pretty helpful. Uh, but yeah, let's just get to the next tip. Uh, my fourth tip is to use an auto clicker if you're on PC. Because the auto clicker can help you like in a lot of things. For example, you, when you want to train, the auto clicker will be much faster than the auto training. Uh, so yeah, if you're playing on PC, you should always use the auto clicker because it will help you improve in this game like a lot faster. My fifth tip is to like rebirth when you have multiple rebirths available. For example, you shouldn't rebirth when you have like uh, one or two rebirths available. Uh, like right now, I have 20 million wins and yeah, I can't rebirth right now, but if I would have like 22 million and just rebirth right there uh, it wouldn't be that much worth it because uh, I wouldn't get that much value because you will keep all of your wins whenever you rebirth because yeah it's just how it works so I would recommend you guys rebirthing when you can do it like five times or something like that because uh, yeah you will get a lot of boosts and yeah it will just be much easier at the game my next tip is to join the games discord server so that you can like trade your pets over there uh, I'm actually I've actually done that and yeah, you can get some pretty good pets from doing that uh, And yeah, if you just get some good values and get, get some good traits You will become pretty OP at this game pretty fast uh, But the only issue is that you have to be on the same area as the one that you're trading Which is it makes it pretty hard to trade some people But yeah, you will still be able to get like some mythic pets or some void pets and yeah all of this stuff so yeah, I will always recommend you guys doing the Discord server trading. Uh, yeah, it's pretty effective. And then my last and seventh tips is to buy trails. And if you don't know how to buy trails, it's basically just go to this paintbrush right here where it says trails. And yeah, you'll find all of these uh, trails. So you can buy the starter one or just any of these. And if you hold your mouse over them, you'll see the boost that they give. So for example, the one that I have right now, the Night Rainbow, uh, it gives plus 80% strength and plus 35% speed boost. Uh, so yeah, the strength actually just applies to the arm wrestling and not like how much you get per click right here when I'm training. So yeah, that's what the trails are doing and that will help you progress a lot, a lot faster at the game. So yeah, that's why you should always buy your trails. And yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. So if you guys want more videos on this game, please let me know in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!